Hello everybody, uh, welcome to another version of Edward S. Redcar's Entertainer Chat. This is the on-the-fly version, uh, actual on location, not Zoom, on location. And today I have the extreme pleasure of talking uh, with Bilal Hussein, who has uh, uh, a script uh, entered into this film festival, as well as a film, a short film. How are you doing today, Bilal? Yeah, I'm doing great. That's good, that's good, that's good. You're looking very, very dapper. Thank you, this so, uh, uh, nice day and uh, watch all uh, name tonight, so. Okay, yeah. uh, would you like to tell everybody about a little bit about what your film is about? Uh, yeah, yeah the, the short film, uh, Where Did the Love Go? is about uh, two serial killers who uh, have had a bad childhood and uh, they hate their mother and due to their upbringing, they have, uh, they have killed uh, many uh, women and the uh, police are after them and then they are like twists and turns. Oh, yeah. good. Now, uh, did that take you a long time, say like from the inception of your idea the movie, yeah, yeah. to the actual release of it? Or was there a long period of time? Well, it's not released yet. It's just uh, yeah, yeah, it's festivals, yeah, yeah. just festivals and many yeah. other. Okay. And it okay. took a long time to write because it was supposed to be a, sh a feature film. Okay. But due to COVID, it uh, got shortened because I didn't know if uh, Denmark would uh, oh, okay. out. Okay. So we yes. made it in, short, uh, in a short version. But if it was a feature film, it would be much better. But the audience here have loved it, so it's good. Yeah, yeah. everybody's having such a good time here. It's yeah. such a relaxed atmosphere, friendly. Yeah. And uh, another uh, another item you have in the film festival is a script that yeah. you have. Would you tell everybody a little bit about that? Yeah, it's uh, I don't know. It's kind of a silly idea, but uh, it's called The Robbers in a Wheelchair. Uh, it's about a couple, a man and a woman, uh, who owe money to a uh, Irish drug dealer, and uh, in order to get their money, they uh, rob houses using a uh, wheelchair. Oh, okay. Well, that's, yeah. a, that's an interesting story. Right? I think uh, when I first wrote it, I thought it's why did I even write it? And yeah, then yeah. Uh, one of my actresses, uh, she read it, and she was like blown away and okay. said, Okay. It's good. Then I said, okay, okay let's uh, yeah. let's try to submit it to festivals, and it's doing good. Right, right. See now, like a lot of times, like people like us as a creator, sometimes we come up with an idea. We don't think it's that great, yeah. but outside of our own box, other people can see yeah. like the greatness or the good quality in it that you know that we can't see. So yeah. it's a good thing that uh, you got good reviews. Yeah, on it. yeah. It was just, it was <laughs> just a silly, and it's also a silly name. No one, uh, in Sonso, you know, there's a dialogue in the script that he, uh, I think the man, uh, the, the boyfriend, he says to his uh, girlfriend that, uh, you know, uh, no one is gonna leave someone in a wheelchair robbing the house. Something well, like that. Well, you know, that would be the first time that you've gotten good feedback and bad feedback, so it sounds like so this is something that uh, that can really take off because it sounds yeah, like people yeah. have have a good idea, have a good uh, con uh, conception of uh, where where this could all take you. Yeah, so, exactly. Uh, yeah. Well, I'd like to thank you thank for you. being on my On the Fly edition thank here at Odas Redcar's Entertainer Chat. And until my next interview, you never know who I'm going to interview next. Uh, stay tuned, take care, and we'll see you next time.